engine one, you're responding to a two-story single-family residence. This may look like a firefighter responding to a blazing house fire. But Ready for water. Ready. But this is all part of a critical skill building exercise here at Clark County Fire Department's training center. When Clark County firefighters are not out saving lives, they're going through intense training to improve their skills to keep our community safe. They're going to have 300 feet of two and a half inch supply. It will be flowing 200 GPM. The first engineer to arrive at a fire scene must provide sufficient amount of water for all fire ground operations that need to take place. Having a water supply is very important to be able to put a fire out. Without water, the fire is not going out. So the engineer's job is very important as being the first engineer on scene. I can't get it. I can't get it. Recently, they completed swift water training and are now starting their engineer academy program that is designed to teach key skills in apparatus operation. You know, one of you is controlling the bucket, then you can go ahead and pin it. The engineers must go through three phases, the driving, pumping, and area operations phase. You know, it's very critical to learn how to drive these big, big apparatus. They're, they're big, they're bulky, they carry lots of water, some of them up to 76,000 pounds, you know, they, they, to driving these rigs with tandem axles. So to have these guys driving this apparatus out in the public is, you know, we put them through advanced driver's training. The water used for this training goes back to Lake Mead and is continuously recycled. These firefighters are passionate about what they do, and ultimately what they learn and train for can be put to good use when emergencies happen. These efforts can help save lives.